Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can run Unreal Engine in the browser. So as you can see, this is one of my projects running in the browser in real time. So as you can see, this is pretty impressive. We'll be using a service called Arcane Mirage. Arcane Mirage is the best pixel streaming platform for Unreal Engine 5. So Arcane Mirage can be used for all sorts of things. It can be used for example to like showcase your portfolio projects. There's also a possibility to implement multiplayer and you could even embed it in a website. So you could embed experiences in external websites. I think that this is pretty cool. So this is the home page right here. You can see all the projects that people have uploaded. Now let's configure the project for pixel streaming. So now you need to do a couple of things here. First, start by launching the Epic Games Launcher. Go to Engine Options. Make sure that you have enabled the Linux option right here. After that, you need to install the cross-compile toolchain associated with the engine version. I'm using 5.3. So I'm going to download this right here. Download and install this. So after that's done, let's open up our project. You can go to project settings. And the first thing that we're going to do is we are going to disable motion blur. This is really important. Next, make sure that hardware accelerated video decoding is enabled. After those options are enabled, go to plugins and search for pixel streaming. Make sure that this plugin is enabled. And that's all that you need to do. So now just build the project. So go to platforms, go under Linux and package your project. Again, make sure that you have installed the associated cross compile tool chain. If you have done that successfully, it's going to show up right here. And now let's package the project. And this is going to take a lot of time. So be patient. So after a few minutes, the project has been packaged. Now before uploading this, we are going to convert this to a zip file. So now we have configured the project and now we can upload it to Arcane Mirage. To upload it, go to Studio. So this is where all your projects are going to show up. Click on Upload New Project. This is the project upload page. So you can upload a thumbnail for your project. After that, upload the Unreal Engine package. So upload the zip file. Now while that's uploading, let's configure some of the other settings. Make sure that capture mouse is enabled. Here you have additional settings for like using a microphone. So if your game uses that, you can enable it. And you can also make your project private. So if you're testing it out, make sure that it's private first. After that, you can set the name for your project, give it a description and add some instructions on how to play the game. Okay, so this looks good. Now the final step is to select your GPU. So here we have a lot of different high end GPUs. So this totally depends on your plan. So if you go to the plans and billings page, here you have three different options. I feel that the Reality Vivo option is the best one, like it's the best value for your money. And again, if you use the coupon code PINKPOCKET20, you will get a 20% off on your first subscription. So make sure that you use that. Again, links are down in the description. You have the Quadro RTX 4000, you have the RTX A4000, A5000 and A6000. So this pixel streaming system works on tokens. Now tokens are consumed when someone is inside your project and the amount of tokens consumed depends on the GPU that you are using. So if you select a lower end GPU, you can see that it consumes less tokens. Okay, so now let's upload the project. So now the project has been uploaded and let's test it out. So as you can see, this is running really fine in the browser. And this is really surprising at first when you do this. I mean, this is Unreal Engine 5 with Nanite and Lumen running in a browser, right? Pretty cool. So as you can see, Arcane Mirage is pretty amazing. I'll really recommend you to check it out. Links are down in the description. So if you like this video, leave a like down below. 
I hope you learned something. Subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. That's it. I'm going to see you guys in the next video.